The blunt has become the quintessential wave move that everyone wants to learn. It's essentially a really fast, dynamic bow end on a wave that looks and feels great when you get it going big. First up, you need to get high on the wave with an angle towards the steepest part of the wave. Use a power stroke to begin to drive the boat on a diagonal towards the shoulder. The more angle you carry into the move, the more you can go edge to edge and therefore the more vertical the blunt will be. As the bow drops, load the bow by driving your heels down. The bow will begin to reel up. You can accentuate this by pulling up on your knees, which will bring your body forward, ready for the next phase. As the bow reaches the height of its bounce, you need to swap edges, keep your weight over the boat and get your paddle across and drop it into the water close to the boat between your hip and knee with your upper body wound up looking into the pit of the wave. This position is much like the double pump position for a flat water cartwheel. Using the support that the blade gives you, snap your legs underneath yourself using your stomach muscles. The paddle should stay still, acting as the pivot point and the paddler should rotate around it. As the stern goes over the top, crunch forwards and flatten out the boat. As the stern touches down, put in a reverse stroke in order to seal the deal. Les minables cachés, les valises à porter, les petits meublés et les maigres pâles. Je me voyais déjà en photographie auprès d'une star l'hiver dans la neige, l'été au soleil. Je me voyais déjà content ma vie, l'air désabusé, à des débuts en friant de conseils. J'ouvrais calmement les soirs de première, le télégramme de ce tout pareil qui nous fait si peur. Et mourant de trac, 